not only is Collective Wisdom a terrific book, but also the background of how it came to be is a, a great story too. And Brett Kelly is the man responsible. We welcome him to GMA. Good morning, Brett. Thanks. Well, I suppose persistence and perseverance, the two Ps would have been pretty important in getting this together. Without a doubt, Bert, I made over 3,000 phone calls and sent almost 500 letters in a period of about five months. So that, that was what made the day for me, just continually calling back. You've got 34 interviews there. A lot of all those phone calls that you've mentioned uh, already. Any knockbacks from prominent people that disappointed you? I think to, to ever get a knockback disappoints anyone, but to get 34 of Australia's most prominent, busy and interesting people to talk to you, out of just 80 that I approached, I thought that was fantastic. And mm -hmm. this was, you know, one-on-one, -on -one, face to face. I wasn't just ringing up and asking to talk to them. So you had to meet them. Um, I, I really wanted to meet them, yeah. Mm. Okay, we've chosen a couple, Bob Hawke. What were your preconceptions about him and what was the reality when you got with him? Well, as Prime Minister, he seemed to come across as a good bloke. Um, and, and then I, I turn up to interview him and he was a good bloke. He sat down for three and a half hours and just talked to us, um, gave me an hour for the interview and then just, you know, smoked a cigar and talked to, talked to me about the world. It was really amazing. Peter Garrett. Amazing. Um, Peter was great in the sense I had 12 interviews and requested. He said, in principle, no problem. And then I went back and back and back and he said, if you'll follow through, I'll do it. Um, so when I had 25 people, I saw him singing on a sidewalk and I thought, it must be time. Um, rang his personal assistant and they said, yep, no problem, come in. It was mm -hmm. incredible. And what was that like, the experience of meeting and being with him? Well, he spent a good good amount of time with me and really showed me some, some different views of the world. Um, his opinion about the value of the environment as an economic resource, even if you don't like looking at it, um, was really insightful. Mm. Who's not there that you would like to have for the second book? Because obviously, if I'm any judge, there's a second book. Yeah, I think to meet Janet Holmes at court, I think she's an amazing woman and it would be fantastic. Um, obviously the distance and she's extremely busy, it'd be great to meet her. I think Rupert Murdoch's an interesting person as well. How old are you? Um, I'm 23 now. It's a terrific start to what you want to have as a, a career in, in journalism and writing? Um, I don't want to just do anything in one area, but I'd like to write books and do other things as well. Yeah. Terrific. Well, congratulations on this. It's called Collective Wisdom. It's by Brett Kelly. We've met Brett this morning and he's done a terrific job and I recommend the book to you. Thanks a lot, Brett, for coming in. Good luck to you.